anybody know what is uh, MC square? What is MC square? Mm -hmm. Einstein's equation. The equation of the area of relativity. Yes. It's a Einstein equation which actually relates energy and mass. Right? Now, can you guess what is EM square? Let me not complicate it. Basically, this is a, a name which my close friends used to call me when I was in the school. So where does it come from? It comes from my house name, Hirayanathilla, and my father's name, Madhavan, and my name, Manoj. Right? So that's how EM square has come. Okay. Now, I am from a... Uh, uh, from, uh, from a village called uh, Rampala in Kerala. I am born and brought up from there. My father was in military engineering service and my uh, mother is a homemaker. I have two sis elder sisters, both are married. I am married and I have two kids. The elder one is studying in 11th standard and the younger one is in 8th uh, standard. Right? Square has come. Actually, uh, my interest was in uh, science subjects and especially in maths. Uh, that's the reason uh, the, my friends uh, started calling me this EM Square. So, in uh, uh, in my middle school, people used to call me uh, like uh, refer me saying that Manoj to God 100% in mathematics. Yes, exactly. So there was an instance uh, in the seventh standard when a class teacher has uh, uh, put a question on the board and uh, uh, requested for the answer. Many students came up with the wrong answer and uh, uh, like all the class started supporting me. I was knowing the answer, but the thing is that I was reluctant to go against the class and I didn't speak up. Now the teacher has uh, ask the students to raise their hands to give the punishment for giving the wrong answer. I complained saying that, see, I didn't support that answer and I was knowing the answer. Do you know what happened? Any guess? So everybody got one beating and I got two beating for not uh, speaking up. Right? So moving forward, I completed my MCA from BMS College in Bangalore. In the final year, there are many companies came for uh, the campus recruitment. This one company which came, they had a, uh, a they had a written test, group discussion, and interview for the uh, for the selection. I cleared the uh, written test with few of my colleagues. So the next was the uh, group discussion. I sit through the session without speaking a single word. Finally, you know what has happened, right? So, coming to my interest, I like especially cricket and football, right? Uh, and chess also I used to play. Now, we had a local team in Kerala and we used to play on in the uh, temple ground. I was the captain of the football team and uh, the vice captain for the uh, football team. So I recall uh, sitting through the whole uh, commentary for the 1983 uh, World Cup when it has happened, when, while, when India beat West Indies. Now, looking back uh, at my uh, school and college days and uh, uh, my current uh, professional career, uh, I, I was an uh, introvert and a shy guy to really go into the stage. Right? So there is an instance which could have contributed to this. So it was in my primary school, there was an uh, annual event which was happening. So every many kids are going to the stage and they were either singing or performing something. When I wanted to do something, what I did, I decided I will go and uh, sing a song from the textbook. I went to the stage, 
basically halfway through I forgot the sum. So that was a big blow to my ego. So now I want to uh, really, I aspire to really uh, in a, uh, become an executive in a uh, with company in next four to five years, my aspiration. And I'm here today uh, to really leverage this platform and take your help to uh, improve my communication and leadership skills. Thank you. Over to you.